What I loved about being on this tour is how everyone unites as a team, uh, as a family on, on the tour. It's always been a dream to come around through Botswana, especially camping. This type of trip is an adventure trip. We generally expect to be putting up our own tents, but in any event, there's always help from the crew. The tents we use are really quite sturdy. They are very thick canvas. As long as you keep it all zipped up nicely, there's no way that the bugs or any other little creatures can come in. The trucks are amazing. From the outside, they look like a truck with a bus cabin stuck on the back of it, but they are specifically made for this type of adventure. It is amazing the amount of stuff that the little nooks and crannies of this truck can actually hold. One thing that's fascinated me on this trip was how positive and exciting and enthusiastic the crew is of three. Enoch, which was our chef on the trip, and he makes some amazing food for breakfast, lunch or dinner. Very good for your body and gives you enough energy for the day. It's very nice. The camping grounds that we use are all pretty secure. That You've got your normal camping grounds that we would have anywhere around the world. Uh, you've got your secure fence around the outside. The only place that we do go on this particular trip where we don't have a fence is the Okavango Delta. But you don't really need a fence out there because you're actually getting in a wonderful mukuru, paddling away down the stream, putting yourselves on an island for a couple of nights with uh, as many polars and guides as we have participants in the group. This has been a very interesting and exciting trip for me, especially being in Africa, seeing wildlife, going on uh, game drives. It grows you as a person and everyone gels so nicely together. And I think that comes from the crew and it influences the team.